Hi YouTube, it's Demetrius again. I wanted to show you guys something that, well, is much needed, in my opinion, for crocheters because I have carpal tunnel. This is a padded handle that I put on a regular crochet hook. And it's leopard print. So it's um it's pretty good. Like it comes up to mid handle, just like you would buy in a bamboo crochet hook. Well, it's padded. As you can hear it, it's pretty tough, and I want to show you guys how to accomplish this. You need a regular crochet hook. See? You have a cutter. I got this for 99 cents at Hobby Lobby. Or, where's my scissors? You can have scissors. And you need a piece of foam paper, which is like maybe 79 cents at Michael's or Hobby Lobby. You can actually buy these by the packs at Walmart. Yes. Oh, and duct tape. Um, you can use regular duct tape, but why not pay five ninety nine and get some fancy duct tape? They have all kinds of colors. They have and patterns. They have zebra print, flames, leopard print, pink Hello Kitty, Spider Man, all of them. So you only need a little piece of this. You're going to. See how tall you need your padding to be. Once you get that, oops, you can eyeball it and just cut it. Toss that away. Don't need any more of it. So now you have a rectangle. And the short side is going to be the height of your handle, short side. You're going to need a piece of your duct tape. I always do this. I pre-cut a shape as you can see. It doesn't really matter. I just need a teeny, teeny piece. Um, this is... Yeah. Mm, pointy finger. Nail size. You're going to take it and put a piece of it on your phone. You're going to line up where you want your phone to wrap around your handle. And press the tape down. So now you have like a flag. Then you're going to proceed to wrap. And as you can see, it's going to bend out. But that's okay. You're just going to wrap and wrap and wrap and wrap. Wrap like your name was Jay Z. <laughs> and you're gonna take your other piece of tape. Use your fingernail to press it in to the foam. And just tack it on to the foam. So now you have what looks like a roller. You know the the foam rollers on a crochet hook. That's exactly what it looks like. That's the raw part. You're going to take Your duct tape, I can't think, and peel a piece. Now, this piece only has to be short and stubby because we're covering the top of it now.
sorry. Drop my scissors. Okay. You're gonna take your little square, cut it in twos, then cut one piece and half again. Okay, we're gonna take the bigger piece, stick it right there on your workspace. And take a long piece, hook it onto one side, and cross it over the hook to that side so it'll meet the duct tape and attach to itself at some point. Check. Then you're gonna take another piece and cross it over. So that's the top of your hook. Now you're gonna take the fatter piece that you have, and you're gonna put it partially on um, the bottom part of your hook, and then partially on the actual metal of the hook. Or if you have bamboo, bamboo of the hook. So now you have that, and you're just going to squeeze it over itself and do a little twist. So now you have the part that actually meets your hook. Now you're going to take a piece that's the length of the tape, I meant width of the tape. and cut about a piece of how much ever you think it's going to take to go around your whole crochet hook. I did maybe four inches. Oh, yeah, four inches. You're going to take your tape and you're going to attach it so that it fits in between the space of where your two pieces end it and you're going to just wrap it around and once you begin to overlap let it overlap for maybe a centimeter or two and cut the excess off but don't throw it away now for the excess we're going to cut it up in two strips again this is why our crochet hook handle looks like so far. You see the pink of my foam that's available? Okay. You're going to take a skinny piece and just wrap it around. Now as you wrap, make sure you press firmly. Oops. Okay, not that firm because I just ripped my tape, but quite firmly. And with that excess piece, you should be able to cover up all your mishaps. Now you're going to take your crochet hook and just roll it in between your hands. Oh, look at my nails. Aren't they fabulous? I don't know if you guys can see the color. But I got um, gold glitter solar nails, and I just I love them. And they're sort of round, sort of stiletto. It's like a stubby stiletto. Yeah, that kind of cut a nail. But and so it's all. and I have my fabulous leopard print handle crochet hook. Again, it's great for people with um, carpal tunnel or just people with arthritis or anything where your fingers cramp up or, you know, because when you're holding a crochet hook without the handle, your fingers are like mashed together. Now, 
the hook on, right? You got like a grip, like a screwdriver. Have fun crafting.